And today, within hours of Russia's unleashing its assault, NATO came together and authorized and activated an activation of response plans. This will enable NATO's high readiness forces to deploy and when and where they are needed to protect our NATO allies on the eastern boundaries of Europe. And now I'm authorizing additional U.S. force capabilities to deploy to Germany as part of NATO's response, including some of the U.S.-based forces that the Department of Defense placed on standby weeks ago. I've also spoken with Defense Secretary Austin and Chairman of the Joint Chiefs General Milley about preparations for additional moves should they become necessary to protect our NATO allies and support the greatest military alliance in the history of the world, NATO.